Beautiful you look, you look absolutely gorgeous. The last time we heard you sing, I remember you made the whole room silent and we were all hypnotised and focused on your vocal. You controlled that beautifully and you really sang it with power like a true diva as well. <laughs> it was really lovely to see. Well done. I think, Rachel, the thing I love about you most is your honesty. You know, we see you in your VTs and when we got to know you when we were doing the auditions, you're very, very funny and you're full of personality, but that truthfulness and that heart really comes out when you sing. I can just see it in your face and your eyes. Beautiful. Thank you, Jane. What a difference between you, the jelly, when we first met you, and now, <laughs> so confident, <laughs> There is one issue I have, though, and I'm going to say this. I wouldn't have sang that song. Uh, I wouldn't, because I think the first, sang you, the, the first song you sang, it defined you as an artist. You know, you are that kind of singer. You come from a West End experience. You chose the perfect song. This is a pop song, and this is, for me, not the kind of record I think you should be okay. performing. So whoever advised you on that song choice, I think was the wrong decision, and I'm frustrated because there's better songs for you to sing. Having said that, you look beautiful, the staging was fantastic, people are going to root for you, and I say this in a, in a positive way because I want you to do well, but it's important you know which lane I think you should be going down. Yeah, cool. Mm. Oh... You're one of the special ones. You really, really are. Because you just need to stand there perfectly still with the song and your voice and your emotions, and it just blended together in something that was really, really wonderful. And I like the song. I like that it was something we don't hear all the time. It was original. You're really thinking, so, so don't listen to everything he says. 